Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Science Wednesday, Exploding Science. So today, the plan, we are going to go upstairs and Auntie Kara is going to teach us all about chemical reactions and atoms. After that, we are going to come down here and explode things. Not be broken down without changing it into something else. And that's what you get when you have chemical reactions. You're changing a chemical into a new chemical. So a physical change is when you change something. Like if you melt water, it's a physical change because you can freeze it again. Okay, it's not a chemical reaction. When you have chemical changes, there's a color change, there's production of an odor maybe, the temperature might change. So we're gonna be using a catalyst today in our first reaction. Okay, so a catalyst is a substance that speeds up a chemical reaction. So we're going to be adding yeast to our chemical reaction to make it happen faster. We are also adding soap and food dye. Why do you think we're adding soap and food dye to this soap. chemical reaction? So, 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 you can you can so you can see it. So the soap helps us see the chemical reaction more. Okay. So the hydrogen peroxide is made up of hydrogen and oxygen atoms. This is the formula. 2H, so 2H means it's two hydrogen atoms, two oxygen atoms, okay? And it can be broken down into two parts, oxygen and water. When a chemical that is only one molecule breaks down into two separate molecules, it's called a decomposition reaction, okay? So we're decomposing hydrogen peroxide. In the bin, you're gonna have a cup with yeast and water. You're gonna get another cup with the peroxide. You're gonna get a water bottle that has soap and food dye. Carefully pour the peroxide into this, okay? Give it a little swirl, don't shake it up. So you're gonna pour it in here, mix it all up, okay? You're gonna add the yeast to this. Alright, so then the chemical reaction is gonna occur and you guys are gonna watch it. <laughs> Thank you. 